Yeah. 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 All the trees, most of the trees died that year from the really? cold. Really? Yeah. That's 60 years ago? That's 60 years. How old were you? I was 12 years old. Wow. Yeah, we arrived July the 4th. The next day I was picking trees, uh, picking, picking cherries on, an, on, a, on a ladder. The next 12, day? Next day, 12 years old. Wow, what a story. <laughs> well, this is the immigrant story. Arrives on, what day of the week was it you arrived? Uh, you remember? I think we arrived on a Sunday. Arrived on a Sunday, Monday yeah. morning, up Pick, picking cherries. Yeah. And you haven't stopped? Nope. 60 years of picking fruit. Ran, what a story. I had another uh, orchard next door. Not next door, because that used to be my dad's, and then mine was two doors over. You look and, strong yeah, well, and robust. <laughs> yeah, All this is the, the great immigrant it's story. Hard work, hard work, hard work. That's my fam my builds family, the that's all our family ever did was work, 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 work. Right. And we're all the same. My yeah. other brother that isn't here, that's part uh, Joe's partner, is uh, the same thing. We're all just work. Every you can't stay in bed. Get yeah. out of bed and get go up, to work. Get up and Keep get moving. at it. Keep moving. Well, that's how the Portuguese helped build Canada. Yes. All across the country. Yeah. That's this. Uh, whether it was construction or whatever. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Right on, Jack. Yeah, good. Thanks well, a lot, my friend. Hey, you better, what a beautiful apple. Right? It isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I understand. You better kick that guy out. We're gonna get him out. <laughs> <laughs> right on, my you don't friend. have to worry about, about me. But <laughs> gonna get the other guys. All right, Jack. Vote for you. I love it. Thank <laughs> you. Good. I am How are you? Parham. Yeah, I don't have a you. I don't have a story like his, but uh, maybe you do. It's just a little, well, a little I, different. No, I started working as <laughs> soon as I could stand up. I was on the farm picking apples, working hard. Did you? up here? Yeah, I did. Uh, uh, born and raised here. In, in Oliver. In Oliver itself? Yeah. Okay. yeah. Yeah. And on an apple farm? Uh, yeah, a fruit farm. You know, back then it was a mix. You had a tree of pears and he could tell them, say yeah, the same yeah. thing and then you had apricots and it, it used to be mixed with everything. So, uh, yeah, and it, you know, we've seen a lot of changes in how we're farming, but still farming. You enjoy it? I love it. Yeah. Yeah. I hope my kids go into it and... You own a farm now? Yeah, I do. Was it, was it your family farm? Uh, yeah, we got the family farm and then I got my own uh, when I was about 25 years of, you know, old. Uh, got my mortgage and got a farm, but that's really hard for my son to do yeah you know it's getting harder and harder and it's getting harder and harder to survive in the farming industry yeah um fruit so. growing industry yeah the fruit because every, that's why you see all these farms getting or orchards getting ripped out and going to grapes right it's part of everybody's chasing the dollar almighty you know yeah i mean they still have high costs just like we do very high but it's uh it's it's still a little bit different yeah. You know, the, the, this is very labor intensive. You know, we can't pick this with machines. Absolutely. You, know, you have to do it all hard by work, hand. Hand, hand work. Hand work. Yeah. We desperately hard need work. some incentives to bring our kids back into the I know. Yes. We'll, we'll, but we're punishing work in Canada, right? If you work, you lose all your benefits and you pay high taxes. Yep. We need to reduce taxes. So, so people bring home more of each dollar they earn and hard work once again pays I, off. I, I, and I, I always say that uh, they say the poverty line is what, 17 or 21,000? dollars yeah I say why does anybody pay taxes under that amount of money yeah. and yet we do yeah. not just the other tax but federal and provincial taxes income tax you know, payroll tax pay, exactly you know yeah and so, those taxes have gone up the so. TD once you go uh, it's like 14 15 thousand that should be up at 24 before any tax takes in the personal exemption you miss. Yeah, yeah yeah you know like and more people are gonna work if they know that up to 25 they're paying zero yeah but now it's so low at 14 that hasn't changed for years yeah and everything else has changed we're not modernizing all our different segments with what's changing so. but the problem is the government is spending yeah. so much money that they have to grab it from everybody's pocket there's nothing free. There's no freebies. That's what I always say. There's no free lunch. Somebody eventually has to That's pay right. it. That's right. Somebody's paying the Somebody piper. has to pay it. Absolutely. And guess who's paying it? You and I that are working yeah, our asses off. There was a question asked in the House of Commons. <laughs> yeah. What are we borrowing this year? I mean, never they answered. didn't know. <laughs> they didn't know. We're, 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 we're going to borrow $410 billion <laughs> this year. That's not. That's the deficit for you. this year is a $40 billion. And then uh, the pre-existing debt that's rolling over into these higher rates, it's up for renewal. 410 billion the government's gonna borrow. You don't think that pushes up interest rates? When the government is comp taking, 400 billion is like uh, the equivalent of two months GDP for Canada. That's how much the federal government alone is going to borrow. So they're competing with you for credit. You know, if you I actually use this example in the house, I said, if the government bought 400 billion apples, apple prices would go way up. If the government borrows 400 billion dollars, the price of borrowing goes up. It's a simple supply and demand reality, and so that's one of the reasons why our interest rates are so high.
Well, I watched one of your videos, uh, one of the standing committees on you know, finance. You said, uh, "Yeah, where did this money come from?" Yeah, you know, and they said, "Nobody knew." Who's the question for you? And you said, "Well, <laughs> anybody on the committee could answer this question, right?" And then you know, it was that Jeopardy song, yeah. you know, ding, ding, and then like nobody had an answer. Where, like, it's pretty simple. Where did the money come from? Like, did you borrow it? Did you tax it? Or like, where did it come from? Yeah, well, that was, that was pretty good. <laughs> yeah, well, so, yeah, yeah, that's the answer you wanted, but that's <laughs> not the answer. Apply. So, yeah. part one, the picture with you. Can I get a picture? So, right, let's do it. Okay, let's bring it home. Mm. You have no idea how good they are. Nice.